Tommy Carping. Real fishing for real people. Carp technicians, join our Facebook community. Oh yeah, welcome to the vid. And this one we're going to the new Celtic Lakes. Just on the way to meet Big P now. Going today, coming back tomorrow afternoon, evening. But yeah man, I'll see you when we get to meet Big P. Here he is, Big P. Getting a Mackey oh. D's and that. In Wales now, going through Monmouth. Just a little interesting fact. Uh, the last ship I was on was HMS Monmouth. Called it the Black Duke. Because the Monmouth before that, back in the day, was the last ship to run away from battle. So it had a black crown on the side of the ship. It was a top 23 frigate. Uh, yeah, Wikipedia it. Good ship, to be fair. Wales is absolutely beautiful, isn't it? Look at this. What a lovely drive, man. We're here at New Celtic Lakes. Yeah, boy. We're here, New Celtic Lakes. All right, me old mate. <laughs> Getting everything dipped, ready to go. Here's the reception and the shop look. Freezer bites only. At the pegs, I'm in peg six here. And yeah, the boat over there in that bay look. We're dropping a rig. Here now, just making up some rigs. Met one air rig and a slip day. Out of this semi stiff end trap. Air rig med, just got a shrink tube it up. Put all the kettle in a minute, just gonna get the other one done. No, I'll get the kettle boiling now, so it's done by the time I've done that. Rod out, two more left to put out. Just got to set the rods up, put the rigs on. So the first rod's out. Big P's yeah. here. Ready to get the other two out in a sec. Just going to attach the bike. Just stuck myself on the back of my t shirt. <laughs> Paul had to come to the rescue.
that. Four, six, seven, eight, nine, eight. Eight, nine, eight. As you seen, I had a run, lost it. To be fair, I'd been giving the fish too much line and that Paul's taught me a few things now about playing fish and that. And really, I ain't had no one really teach me now. A few odd bits here and there, but since I've been fishing, because I don't really know. Well, I do now know people who've got, but I didn't when I started, do you know what I mean? So I'm just like, sort of half learned as I've gone along. It's good to be taught a few bits, like. So go near enough locked up straight away? Well you, you've got to be locked up because ah, otherwise okay. your fish is gone. You give them too much slam and the hook won't pull on properly. Okay. So grab the spool like that, yeah. right? Then pull it up. Yeah, then twist it in your front, right? And then play the fish then you can go like that. And if you've got your hand over the spool, right, you can let it off, off, yeah. off with your Nah, nothing. It come towards and then went. I don't know, it's not fighting. Yeah. Must be. 
No spin unless it's going to go on a mad run in a minute. <laughs> oh! Get it! I've got him. Yeah? Yeah. Take your time. Take your time now. Nice crap you've got there. That's it. Now what? Yeah? Now give it just a... Here we go, first one of the session, lovely common. Let's get it back. There we go. Oh! That's it. Go on, grab him, go on, in. Into them bushes. Going well, the poor leg got his rods out. Yeah, so <laughs> wait till these are out as well. <laughs> oh man, oh, yeah. So <laughs> I better get all my rods back out. I've bloody had my bike boat back. We'll be ran out in a minute by this. Oh dear, had to go and buy some more bike, and he brought four kilo though. some Odysseys. Big P's doing his rigs up, look. Hopefully have some more fish, definitely.
as you've seen, I had another one. And then I had a tie on that one where it must have come off. Also, a saw in that one. But yeah, man, it's going off. Holes in. Monster, but it's a little cat. Quarter to eight, it's changing the rigs up. Some air rigs on, and some monster catfish bite on it. It's trying to go towards yours. Cross Gorby. Yes. Twenty six pound mirror. Oh, Sam, that was twenty six pound mirror. Twenty six four. Twenty six four, absolutely covered in fish line. We love it, don't we? Swipping up a bit of steak. You know, get the protein in me and that. Lovely. Carp number five, 20 pound, four ounces. Carp number, is this number six? Yeah. Carp number. Quarter to one. It's carp number six. Caught on the monster cat bait again. Smashing it for the carp as well. Here we go. Carp number seven. By the end, not on pound. I think it's two or three o'clock in the morning. And a one bit on the other alarm over there as well. 20 past 3, just had another one. Carp number 7, sleep. <sighs> morning. Next morning now, 20 to 8. Let's get some rods ready done, man. Let's have some fish there, there's big peel up. Yeah. Oh, we've had seven cat, carp and a broom. Seven, <laughs> okay now. We've had seven carp. A cat and a brain. Mental. Best session ever. Bloody long like, doubled or trebled me combined total weight I've ever caught in one session. Well doubled it easily, yeah. Not like 94 pounds or something. Yeah, <laughs> first one in the morning. Rod's literally been out for ten minutes. I even, I was I was boating the other rod out, the other boat still are rods half boated out in the water. We've had this bad boy here. First one of the morning. Lovely, I ain't pound mirror. <laughs> 
had to leave my boat stranded in the middle of the water so I could go and hit that run. It's a hate car up there and a brain. I think it is smashing in the morning coffee. Wicked session, man. Class. And I've learned a lot playing the fish properly and that. Backing your hand on the spool and tightening it when you pick it up. Because it sets it up better. I know I used just to pick it up and let it up. But it's still taking along, you know what I mean? Everything, little adjustments, makes you better, doesn't it? Paul been fishing me, he's a really good angler. Look. Oh, that coffee be ready. Yeah. <laughs>
see it back again. So put my hand on the razor. No. Turn him. Happy days. Let's get him back. <laughs> I'm buzzing. I literally said to Paul an hour ago, I said, the only thing that can turn this from the best session ever to a perfect dream session is my first ever catfish. And then I've had it. 23 pound. <laughs> Absolutely buzzing. Oh man. What a session. Fantastic. Yeah, Celtic likes. My first ever cat, nine carp, a bream. Paul's had two cats. Oh, the place is phenomenal. Neil, the owner, and his missus sound. Got a right tackle shop set up. Like one we're on. And it's phenomenal. Definitely, definitely, definitely coming back. Cannot recommend it enough. I've got a fish here, yeah, but I don't know. I don't think it's a bream. Because it started coming in easy, now it's starting to fight a little bit.
<laughs> Lower back work out man. Yeah. Reckon he's bigger? Yeah. He'd go 30 either. Yeah. Yeah. Not a monster, but on the monster cat bait again. Yeah, on the monster cat bait again. <laughs> She's seen another one, two PBs in an hour, smashing it up, man. Nearly one o'clock now. Right, it is overcast, but it is roasting. I'm dying for a little bit of breeze. I'm going to go stand over there in a second. That road, a right, little bit of a wind tunnel. Get some more water down me now. Know what the best session ever won't be complete with that? Cheeky pot noodle. Big P's got the cheeky pot noodle on look. We love it. <laughs> Neil's here, look. Pop down to see us. He's doing a bit of grads work and that.
in. Yes. There we go. 40 pound, two ounce. Made a bit of an error and didn't press record when I picked it up before I picked it up out of the trough. But got the photo and that. Got the footage playing it, so Brucey bonus, and it is the photo of it, just in case. And I'll put it beforehand as well. But yeah man. Happy days. Banging session I'm starting in the shade because it is roasted. Pull that here, look. Sun dweller. I'm having a couple of minutes just cooling off. Oh man, as you can see, packing up. Wicked session, man. Just over 24 hours, like 28 hours or something. We've had nine carp, five cats. Do bream. So yeah man. Fantastic session. And I said just pack it up now. Day after now. Just finished work. Just on my way to the gym to smash shoulders out, but yeah. What a session. I used to film these outros on the bank, but now I'll give it a day to reflect. But yeah, what a session. Nine car. Three cats I had. Um, they were in like numerical sequence order as well, and I was 22 to get me used to it, then a 29, then a 40. Sweet. Definitely going to be doing some more catfishing. <coughs> 100%. Yeah, defo, man. Really enjoyed it. Might need to step up some gear for it. Like, you know what I mean? Get some bigger test curve rods and some meatier line, and that's if I'm going to be trying to get some bigger ones. Be a fantastic session. Recommend new Celtic lakes, defo, hundred percent. I can't wait for you to see the big project I've got coming up. Got a big trip coming up. Can't wait to share that with you. But yeah, man. If you like the video, please subscribe. Join Carp Technicians Facebook group. Don't forget to check out Monster Catfish as well. Yeah. Um, well, the best session I've ever had. Defa. Fantastic. Then we're doing some longer sessions from now on, some more worthwhile sessions rather than just a few hours at a time. Right? Still going to do a few hours at a time occasionally. But it's time to step it up, do some longer sessions at some good venues, you know what I mean? Yeah, man, time to up the levels again. Right, yeah, thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.